Hey, what's up YouTube? My name is Dennis and this is my 2019 Toyota Tacoma. So as you can see there, I have a tent rack. I was going to sell this and buy a camper shell, but when I was looking online, man, the price are between $2,000 to even $4,000. They are kind of expensive, so I just decided to keep this one for now. So I put a plywood on top, I painted it and put a sealant on there, but in the summer it started to peel. So the first one here is my work platform. I bought this at Lowe's for 60 bucks. You can buy this on Amazon, but it's going to be a little bit expensive. This here is my 50 foot air compressor hose in reel. I bought this from Lowe's. It's connected to a Craftsman air compressor. This is a 60 gallon 150 PSI for 119. This is a 50 foot extension cord. I got this from Amazon for 64 bucks. And I have it secured with a shelf bracket. I got this from Lowe's for nine bucks. This is my 100 foot pressure washer reel. I got this from Amazon for nine five bucks. This here is a Flexzilla, it's a 50 footer, I got this from Amazon for $63. I lost the metal clip that's supposed to attach to my hose reel, so I just secured it with a bungee cord for now. I also secured it with a twist tie here, this is just an easy access for me. I had this fire extinguisher here. I bought it from Amazon. It's good for boat and automobile. I got this because, man, you never know when you need it. All right, so for the inside, I have another plywood right down here. Underneath it are three 2x4s and this is for extra storage. This here is my generator. I have it covered because I'm getting ready to replace it. I'll show you guys what I have in my next video. So this here is my 35 gallon water tank. I can only find a 30 gallon picture here so they might have run out of the 35 gallon one. I used to have a shut off valve right over here, but it started to leak, so I removed it. Now my white connector here is leaking. 
So this here is a hose where I can wash my hands or fill up my buckets. This here is my water pump. It's by Utility Tech. I bought this from Lowe's for $119. I have another white connector right here. The one on the right goes to my pressure washer. And the one on the left goes back to my water tank. This here acts as my return hose, so I won't burn up my water pump. This is also where I fill up my water tank. I have a quick connect for my garden hose. Lastly, this is my Craftsman pressure washer. It's a 2100 PSI with 1.2 GPM or gallons per minute. I like this pressure washer because it automatically turns off and turns back on when you're ready to use it. Alright guys, so there you have it. This is my truck setup. On my next video, I'll show you guys the products and tools that I use and how I fit everything in my truck. If you guys have any questions, suggestions or any improvements that I should do, please let me know. I would really appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on my next video.